Hello Texans, I'm Channing Flatt and welcome to a very special homecoming episode of Texan Sports Minute. The Texans are taking on Tarleton's rival team in true homecoming fashion as A&M Kingsville invades Tarleton. But first, let's check out what happened last week. The Texan volleyball team took on Eastern New Mexico last Saturday and recorded their eighth straight win by the way of a three-set sweep. The Texans were dominant throughout the game on both defense and offense. In the winning set, the Texan defense held the Greyhounds only six points. This win marked a very special milestone for the Texans because of their fifth straight win in only three sets, a feat that hasn't been accomplished since 2008. In the football, the Texan football team traveled to Port Tales, New Mexico to take on the Eastern New Mexico Greyhounds. The Texans had a very impressive defensive showing. They only allowed 16 points on the night. The Texan defense was especially stingy against the ground game as they held the Greyhound offense to 100 yards less than their average. This is an especially impressive achievement as the Greyhounds came into the game with the second best rushing offense in the nation. On the other side of the ball, the Texan offense had an impressive night, especially through the air. Zed Warner hit his star wideouts Jeff Thomas and Del Michael High, who each had over 100 receiving yards on the night. With this win, the Texans moved their winning streak to three, going into homecoming week. Speaking of homecoming, let's talk about this week's rivalry matchup. A&M Kingsville is the Texans' main opponent this week. The Texan volleyball team traveled to Kingsville to take on the Pigs, and the football team plays their homecoming gang in Stephenville against the Havelinas. In volleyball, A&M Kingsville got a little revenge by snapping the Texans' eight-game winning streak. The Havelinas took the Texans to five sets for the first time in nearly a month. Despite the loss, Haley Roberts recorded her 8-30 kill game. The night was also special for Autumn Taylor, who had a career-high 15 kills. The Texans put up a good fight, kept it close in all sets. With this loss, the Texans moved to 17-3 overall and 9-2 in the Lone Star Conference. Tomorrow, the Texan football team goes into their matchup with the Havelinas riding a huge wave of momentum. The Texans will look to extend their winning streak to four games with a win this Saturday. The Texans are currently sitting in a tie for second place in the LSC after riding the three-game win streak. With just four games left in the season, the Texans will look to keep the momentum going all the way into the LSC championship. Well, that's all the sports Tarleton can play in one week. Be sure to check us out next week for all the sports your hearts can handle. Signing off is Channing Flat.